away from Pushchair Expert. The Quinny Herb is an exciting pushchair that has the ability to grow with your family and take on many different forms. The chassis of the Herb is strong and solid. It's almost spider-like in its appearance with a long curve of the chassis into the wheels which are very much one at each corner. With its strength does come a little extra weight. You don't feel the weight much at all when pushing though, only when cornering or pushing up hills with two fully laden seats on board. Everything about the Herb is quite striking. It's different to any other models out there, which is a standout feature of this versatile pushchair. The wheels are chunky and foam filled, which means they can travel over many terrains without the constant worry of being caught short with a puncture. The storage basket is colossal. The huge area is rectangular in shape and covers the whole of the pushchair chassis. It can be accessed front and back and has a small elasticated pouch to the rear, which is really handy for popping smaller items into. As is the case with many tandem pushchairs, when an additional seat or carry cot is added to the chassis, you do lose some basket space to accommodate it. With one seat on the frame, and even with one seat and the toddler board in place, there was more storage space than we needed for a family trip out with three children. However, when a carry cot is in place, or a second forward facing seat, the storage space is reduced to allow space for the toddler's legs, or the length of the carry cot. The handle is adjustable, so fine for me, although at its highest height, it's still reasonably low for our six foot one tester. The simple brake pedal is large. You do have to have a quick look for it if you've got the carry cot in the back position on the chassis, but it really didn't pose an issue once we got the hang of where the pedal was positioned. The smart, multi-purpose nature of the hub means it can be used as a simple single push chair or a push chair for siblings of different ages. But take note, it can't be used with two carry cots for newborn twins. Although Quinny offered the Hub Cocoon, which is laid in the main seat unit to create a flat space for baby and make it suitable in the first six months, this is intended as a more budget friendly option for those who don't want to purchase the Hub's carry cot and the Hub is not approved for twins for birth in the UK. In its simplest form, the Hub is a single push chair with space by the bucket load. The seat can sit on the chassis in numerous positions, parent or world facing. It can be used as a single carry cot for one child from birth to. There's also the option to use the Hub as a single with the additional XXL shopping basket attachment. This gives an extra 10 kilos of storage space on top of the already good 10 kilos in the pushchair basket. 20 kilos of storage space is pretty impressive. For siblings with a fairly standard age gap of between one and two and a half years, the Quinny Hub is definitely flexible. There are a few options to choose from. You can use a carry cot with a sibling seat, an infant carry with a sibling seat, two sibling seats, or a sibling seat and a handy hop on board, which is a jump seat for toddlers or children. If you have a child who mostly walks but still needs a rest every now and again, we found the hop on board really useful. It looks sleek and stylish and positions itself well on the pushchair chassis. It's quite slippy for little bottoms to perch on though, so make sure those toddlers hold on tight. One thing we loved about the hub with any of the configurations that we tested is that each child has plenty of space to travel comfortably without being cramped by the other passenger. This is a real bonus in the world of tandem and convertible pushchairs. The bucket style seats mean that baby sits comfortably and clean against the sheltered sides when napping. The fabrics covering the seat unit are modern and vibrant yet still very usable. They can be wiped down with baby wipes and appear as good as new again. The luxurious seat liner is by far our favourite accessory for the hub. Its suede materials were wonderfully comfortable for baby and complement the seat unit perfectly. Even the smallest of details have been thought out on the seat unit, including a hard wearing area where it's needed most, right where muddy wellies and shoes will be resting. We love the harness because there are no fiddly clips to piece together before buckling up. The two prongs click straight in and out of the buckle quickly and easily. The shoulder pads on the harness are cleverly made of rubber which has anti-slip properties to ensure the harness stays secure in the correct position on baby and they can't wriggle out of their safety restraint. There's also a bumper bar that opens with a pivoting action, making it easy to get baby in and out of the seat. The seat can be reclined with just one hand using a button on the back. The hood is very large and almost completely covers baby when fully extended. The modern materials are thin but still have that all important UPF 50 plus rating. A mesh peekaboo window allows you to check on baby too. The chassis of the Quinny Hub has been designed to allow for plenty of space for its passengers. Even when there are two passengers on board, both children have plenty of space, as well as a great view of the world. Both seats are tall and wide and very comfortable for babies, toddlers and even younger children. All of the combinations were easy to achieve with the correct adapters and finding the right seating option to suit our children's ages and individual personalities and needs was easy too. There are three ways to use the Quinny Hub from birth when in its mono form. With an infant car seat, 
with the pushchair seat and a front berth cocoon, and also with the Hooks carry cot. The carry cot has a hard bodied minimalistic design, and the first thing we noticed was its great size. The sides are deep and it has great length, which means baby can stay in that all important lay flat position for longer. The same great hood as appears on the seat unit shades baby and provides protection from the elements. The bumper bar acts as a carry handle when lifting the carry cot on and off the frame. Removing the carry cot is achieved for the two buttons on each side of the carry cot adapters. The memory buttons can be pressed one at a time, allowing you to remove the carry cot with just one hand. To fold the hub, it's best to remove the seat units, carry cots and accessories. Any additional adapters can be left in place. Press the buttons on the handlebar simultaneously and the handlebar drops down to join the wheels of the chassis. Due to the design and size of the hub's footprint, the overall fold size is quite large. Even with wheels removed, we need a plenty of boot space to accommodate the pushchair. If you look quirky and unique, then you're sure to be drawn to the modern and individual design of the Quinny hub. As a mono Australia, it really is a force to be reckoned with thanks to its XL sun canopy, luxurious comfortable seat and chunky tackle anything wheels. Not forgetting the jaw-dropping XXL 20 kilo shopping basket capacity. As a duo, however, it's not quite as uncompromised. While it still offers a wide range of easily changed configurations for two pushchair seats, as well as accommodating a seat unit and carry cot, it's not designed to cater to twins from birth. Frustratingly, if you have a slightly larger age gap, it's also not possible to attach a carry cot and the clever hop on board at the same time. This handy bench seat is a great idea for toddlers or preschoolers who want most of the way, but just need an occasional lift. It can only be used once their younger sibling has progressed to the pushchair seat unit. Folding is certainly simple, but weight and size must be taken into account if you plan on transporting the pushchair in small cars or on public transport. There's no doubt about it that wherever we stroll, the Quinny Hub turned heads. We give the Quinny Hub four out of five stars. Head over to pushchairexpert.com to read our full review.